Now we are going to create the, the, we are going to, to create three versions of the same photo. Uh, what we are going to do is to do a color edition. So we go to the color to the menu colors and for example we can apply the threshold. Look, when you apply the threshold, what you have is a two bit color image. You can modify if you want it more white or more black. And then when you are happy, say okay. And then this is one version. So you could spot this and use this in the mosaic if you like it. This another another possibility is not to have a two color uh, photo, but uh, um, gray scale photographing, which is for me is better. Okay. This is okay. This is the you can modify. If you like like this or like that, okay, you can do as many modifications here so that you adapt the picture as you like it. I recommend to use always the erase the shadows because it's going to be nicer. And when you're happy with it, you can spot it. Let's do it. I spot this. Spot us and this, and I call it version version one, okay, and spot it. Spot, and I have the version one of the Alpujarras two. Okay, so I can put this in the bottom, or I can make it disappear. What else can I do? I can, for example, do one effect that I like it, that is the saturate, the, the, the posterizing effect. Look. Okay. Um, so you, you can apply the levels here. Normally you can modify, okay? If you, if you like this, okay, or that, or this, depending on what you prefer. Let's apply this. Okay, if you, if you think that this effect is too hard, you can put this on it and then modify the transparency so that you can make appear the effect. And even you can desaturate this photo into a grayscale and then this is, okay, that was how the, the, the initial effect is, and this is if you have the, the photo on it, you can choose. You prefer this, you prefer that, okay? Let's imagine that you don't like the, the, this effect on it, then this is what you like it, then you export this as, in this case, version two. 